Buffalo's bicycling community is growing by leaps and bounds, and tonight that community paused to reflect on a tragic crash that claimed the life of one of their own. 29-year-old Sarah Rogers, a beloved and well-respected musician in Buffalo, was riding her bike with two others when they were hit by a car. Rogers died, and the two others suffered serious injuries. Police believe the driver suffered a medical emergency before the crash last week. Tonight, Olivia Proya takes a look at how Rogers is being remembered along with a renewed push to try and make the roads safer for bike riders. Honoring the memory of a fellow rider. This is a member of Buffalo cycling community and a very cherished member of our Buffalo community as a whole. And um, we just wanted to gather people from all corners of the cycling community to uh, show that when someone is killed on the road that it doesn't go unnoticed, um, they won't be forgotten, and that the cycling community shows up. Members of Slow Roll took time during their freedom ride to honor a fellow cyclist. 29-year-old Sarah Rogers was hit and killed June 17th while riding her bike with friends on South Park Avenue around 9 p.m. I barely knew Sarah. I really only knew her uh, from an audience member to the stage. Uh, she just exuded joy and love and care. And with that in mind, we can quite easily carry her with us because she gave us so much to carry. She left a wonderful legacy in only 29 years. A legacy her family says in a message to slow roll that should live on when others enjoy the simple pleasure of biking. She was a champion for loving yourself and doing what was right for you and in turn supporting others who were disenfranchised. Thank you for taking just a moment to reflect on Sarah's life and others, other loved ones who we have lost. Now, this community of riders pushing for safer road conditions. You know, this is a path that very many of us take quite often. So um, the fact that she was killed here, uh, I think, sent a shiver down a lot of our spines. New legislation is in effect that will ticket cars for parking in newer, wider bike lanes. But Buffalo Common Council member Joseph Golumbek says there's more to be done. This is a human life that was taken from us, and, you know, we need to do everything that we can to make sure that walking, biking is safe for all people. Olivia Proya. Ride safely, ride with love, ride with Sarah. 7 News, Buffalo.